Man, that's choppy. I don't know why. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another day of Black Ram GX streaming. Thank you, Marcus, for the nice comment there. Happy streaming, bro. Thank you for the like and for the shares. <clears throat> I believe I may have seen Mr. Pitsy stopping in as well. Thank you, Mr. Pitsy, for uh, dropping by and dropping the like. Good to see you. I haven't seen you in a long time. Um, but it was good to see everyone coming back. So we're back. We're playing more Pokemon uh legends arceus today we are in the alabaster ice lands which i think is the last area at least it's where the last lord is um uh, might be another area after this don't know because the amount of unknowns aren't adding up so something's gotta something's gotta happen here anyway uh if it's your first time joining us here uh please drop a follow appreciate that a lot if you've been here before drop a like share comment stars whatever you feel like doing if you're over there on youtube thanks for watching good to see you uh if you're new over there subscribe and if not um like and leave a nice comment check out the youtube black cream gx gaming every full stream goes up there every night and tons of great shorts we just put up one earlier today of the shiny ponyta evolution that was pretty good everyone likes the shinies um shiny shorts that's a good name for them shiny shorts so uh <clears throat> had to put that one up anyway let's get down to it we're over here at 85 hours how'd that happen oh that's right we just got these three so we got to work on there oh hello everybody pokedex entries This one we could do too. We'll have to see what happens. Alright, so we'll work on this one first. Esper Wing and Brave Bird. Where are we going here? So it wants us to go here. But I say we go up here and check out this Oh. This area around here. Oh, and there's also this. And this. Maybe we'll backtrack. Sneezler. What? Oh, look at that, another will o -wisp. And a wild cat hiding out behind me. I wonder what she's up to. This hole was here on the map. We had not explored it yet. Ah! Let's take a gander. <laughs> it seven times we might as well just feed it seven times um, and then we'll catch this one where does this guy want it's just hanging out pushing me around what a jerk He's rather friendly. Okay, so this one's gonna try to fight me. I think I'll just back off. Alright, not gonna work. I guess we'll just catch him. I have to find another one. By the way, everybody. Cheers. Mm. 
might as well use some moves on you. I know this guy doesn't want none, but he's gonna get some. Hmm. I don't remember which way he wants me to do this. So let's just take a let's take a swing at it. Shouldn't be up to five on that guy anyway. It was strong style, nice. So up to five on him. I guess I'll just leave that there. So I know I've done it. I know I've done it, but you know. Whoa, I'm a champ. I mean, we all knew there was going to be one eventually, right? And he's an alpha man. I already had an alpha. Now I gotta dump him. Now I don't gotta dump him, but I might. This is perfect. This is an absolutely perfect area to get Braviary done. Oh. Down there was a Will O Wisp. Nice, nice. All right. Left or right? Let's try left. I see it, I see it. We'll come back for it. Just checking out the arena. Where we will be fighting Avalug. We've got our mysterious music going. That's what I like. I don't like that. Look at tongues swimming in ice cold water. What are they thinking? Who developed this game? Alright, let's try to get off one more brave bird here. That might be enough. Might be enough for us to be done with Braviary. Actually pretty legit. Oh, I didn't see that recoil. 
Eight, so I need two more Esper Wings. Well, the camp is right over here. Looks like this camp's a little more dangerous than most. There's actually a lot of pretty strong things right around. Alright, so now we need to do two Esper Wings. Just two. Okay, that didn't work. But this one will. This will only probably take one. Dear God, I hope this only takes one. not go to plan. Oh, shenanigans. about that time, I'm going to have to go check out that distortion. Ooh, but I want to beat up one of you real quick. But beat up, I think just one more. Maybe just one more. Perfect. Uh, we'll be done. I'll have to confirm that. And he's done. Bada bing, bada boom. All right. One more Esper wing. That's doable. Gotta take out this cute, cuddly little snow pig. He's fine. It's fine. Agile style, close combat, or a sphere. Already up to five. Michael Payne, what's happening, buddy? Cheers. Just out here beating on small Pokemon with Lucario. You know, doing what you gotta do. Dang good. Good afternoon, South Aussie. No kidding. And good night, Midwest North America. <laughs> Ooh. 
little bit all over the place here. You're only ahead by... What? 18 hours? I'll catch up to you. Don't worry about it. No, I won't. Ooh, Uncanny, what's going on? How are you doing, buddy? Cheers. Okay, so he's at three, five, seven. Yeah, he's done. All right, high horsepower, blizzard strong. What up, what up? What's going on with you, buddy? Anything new? Any new games? Not that I saw, but... Ash Ketchup. Remember they made some joke... Uh, like that in... The cartoon in the first season. It was like... Two gyms in one place. One guy had an Electabuzz. One had a... Um, Scyther. And they had to come up with fake names. So he was Tom Ado. Because he was looking at ketchup. So it made him think of Tomato. Tom Ado. I didn't get it for the first one or two times that I saw it as a seven year old. And then when I did, it was such a face slap. Not lately, still waiting on some of my items on my wish list to drop. Oh, sure, sure. What are you waiting for? If you don't uh, mind dropping hints. I was excited for a little number called Stalker 2. That was supposed to come out in March. And now it comes out in December. I even had it downloaded and everything. Quite a shame, but whatever. If it wasn't ready, it wasn't ready. I'm really using Blizzard against. Oh my god, me? Got a War Resident Evil 8 and a few others. You haven't played 8 yet? Oh my god. <clears throat> it's gonna have to change. It's gonna blow your mind. Have you watched other people play it? Or will it be all new for you? I haven't played it. It's not right. I haven't played it since it first came out. It first came out, I played it once, beat it, played a little bit of the harder difficulty, and that was that. I think something else came out that I had to play. I don't remember. Don't watch spoilers on that topic. It was pretty tough to avoid uh, watching any spoilers on that game. I mean, I was playing it day one. But like, I even muted the chat. Because I was just that unwilling to uh, let something possibly get spoiled. Nice. Get our boy Garchomp back in here. Maybe. 
Do we actually have to do anything more with the white kid? No? Oh, he's, uh, tradable. Sometimes it's hard to avoid those spoilers, though. It's a normal ghost. Well, I got room in normal, so let's put it there. So we can evolve it. And you snarl. Might actually take Frostlass out first here. It's one agile move. Yeah, it's hard to avoid spoilers for sure on uh, some games out there. Especially after it's been out for a while, but maybe now that it's been out for a while, maybe it's a little easier. Because you don't have uh, as much people playing it or looking at it. Not as much hype. It's already out. Is he making fun of me? Because I got two? What is he doing? This professor. He didn't even pay me well. Alright, everyone's done but this guy. No big deal. You do enough snarls. Should be fine. Three snarls and an evolve. This hasn't happened yet. I think and I'm thinking that maybe Zorua won't get absolutely dominated in here. I don't know that for sure. Uh, maybe some of these swine notes. Alright, two moves to my one was dirty. Just gonna have to teach him a lesson. Oh god, he's ground. God, and he's an escape artist. Looked if I really let me down here. Nope, didn't even bring him back to life. My bad. Maybe I can get the drop on these guys. He'll have a chance. We'll get a bunch of snarls in. Be all good. Let's see what we gotta do to evolve him, though. Is there anything secretive? Is it just a level? Oh, the shiny ones look cool. Level 30. Okay, that's not bad. I think. I think he's 28. Yeah, he is 28. Let's 
So we'll do four more. Let's get him up to eight before we evolve him. Should be good. Oh, the trap failed. There's another Electify? I guess I don't... Yeah, need is a strong word, but I'm still gonna catch him. I've already got two Alphas. So far from need, but... But... Worth a lot of money. Maybe I'll trade him. Another one? The scissors there. They just can't hurt Garchomp, so this is a perfect one to mess them up. Also, I forgot this was a new Garchomp. I had one that was like level 79 or something, and then I found this 85 out in the wild. So we gotta assess his moves here. False swipe can't have that, no. I feel like the one I had had a different ability that was just better. But I don't know. Gail, thank you for the like. Cheers. How are you doing? Oh my Antilanta. Let's see. If they'll all fight me. Oh, they won't? Just this guy? Yeah, that's alright. Catch them one at a time. Actually, I don't know if I want any of the other guys. I gotta finish finding all the items. Oh, you grew enraged. What about me? You should have gotten that ball. Now I gotta do this. I don't want to do this. He made me do it. Dang, that almost hurt. You know, this level 85 guard chomp, I might have switched back. Take out the weaker one. If only because I like the moves of the other one, and I did just remember that I gave the other one all the grits. Grit gravel, grit rocks, grit sand, grit... Whoa, hello! What?! <laughs> we are catching this one, though. This one. In the bag. A shiny scissor. <laughs> Did I see that coming today? No. We got him. That is sexy. I couldn't agree more, Michael. Holy shit. I heard the little shine noise. And I thought it was just going to be 
a spiel or whatever they are. Not spiel, but something regular. Did not think that was about to be a scissor. <laughs> oh, I feel good about that one. We can all fight now. I got exactly what I wanted, and I didn't even know I wanted it. Doing things the right way. Oh no. Evie, you just became prime suspect. Suspect, that's not right. Target number one? Target number one. Might actually catch him because he's pretty beefy. And Electabuzz can't do anything, whatever, he's fine. <laughs> do we ever see Shiny coming? No. But when we get it, it's an awesome feel. I couldn't agree with you more, Michael. Like, you have an idea when you go to an outbreak that it might be there. And that feels good uh, when you go there and there actually is one. A lot of times there isn't, so you're disappointed. But when it just randomly pops up like that... Oh. oh, I didn't think he was raging. Couldn't agree more, though. It's absolutely the best feeling. I like that it's kind of green. It's like a light green. Slightly lighter than uh, Scyther. Oh, so you escaped, huh? Let's see where that gets you. A one-way trip to... I don't know, they shrink up. Are they gonna join Ant-Man in the Quantum? Realm? Quantum Verse? What is it? Quantum something. Took me a second to even remember that part. Alright, let's take out Walrene first. Come on, Electabuzz, you can't do that. crank this up. Quantum zone. Is that what it is? Okay. I just knew it was quantum something. Guard chomp is so good. I've got two alphas. Maybe I should just carry two around with me. have a new oops new move here Let's see what that is shadow claw that's better than swift allegedly but that means stuck in the phantom zone that's true or being on a highway to the danger zone I did not mean to throw you out here little guy I'm so sorry he didn't stand a chance. Well, that's kind of a waste of a revive and everything. I knew better. I just wasn't paying attention. Samuel Anderson, what's happening? Thank you very much for, oh, for the like and the share. Cheers. What's going on? What's going down? See that? Stepping on his tail at the end. Disrespectful, but you know what? Had to help out my Electivire. Had to make sure you got a clean shot.
That's what's kind of nice about when these guys come up. If you're on your uh, weird deer, you can just come up right behind them while they're doing their uh, little intro. Hit one of them for the unawares and, uh, oh, that. Or beat them up, you know, your choice. Most of the time, I've been finding I throw myself into fights too quickly here. If they're shiny, you just go for it. You don't waste any time, you know. Unless it's one that'll run away. Then you gotta play that super careful. But if it's more aggressive guys like this, you can let them take the shot at you. And then just get them behind. Ooh, we're gonna make some money after this. What I really need to find is where shield dons show up. Saw the one in that uh, disturbance, time disturbance, in the highlands. Not since. They gotta be easier to find somewhere else than this. Kinda curious on that one. Shield on locations. Alright, it's over. Check out this. So we gotta go up here and check this out. I kind of did yesterday when I was looking for the guy from the camp. He was disappointingly closer than I thought. It looks like they will just come up in time distortions. Anywhere in the highlands. And the chances are extremely low. Unfortunate. Let's look at this thing one more time. Look at that. I'm pretty impressed. Maybe we'll bring shiny scissor with us. Something we got here, yep. No, oh, it's actually the best EV we got. Alright, so let's dump these clowns. Yeah. Thanks for all the grits. Ooh. Before I forget, I do want to trade that guard chomp. Even though this one's way higher level. I just like that I already worked on the other one. You should see Sheldon shiny. It looks pretty mad. It did look interesting. Its body is a brighter yellow and its head is like a navy blue. Which I did find that part to be pretty cool. Alright, guard chomp. Iron head. Iron head was the one that this one just... Happens to already have that. This one does not seem to be able to get. So, he's nine levels younger, but all his stats are ten, so he's actually kind of better. And uh, he'll keep getting better. And Polyon and Torterra need to get a few items in them. Let's see. Oh, 
Oh, the perfect amount to finish off Tortea. There he is. Hey, who knows? Maybe Shiny Sheldon is what will show up next time. I guess I'll have to just hang out in the Highlands for five minutes at a time, waiting for those uh, time distortions. That sounds awful. I will probably do that off the stream. Maybe. I feel like my chances aren't too high, but you never know. If this is a quest, I didn't realize it. A request. Um, if it's not, what are the chances? No. Oh, hey, look at that. Let's see what I've done here. Let's do the new wares so this guy can stop asking me about it. You won't stop. God. Shiny Scizor. That is just awesome. Most illuminating. I'm looking at the wrong thing. There we go. Yeah, just slightly lighter green. So we can mark them if we have alphas. Yeah, not as cool as shinies, though. Doesn't really change the picture of it much. You know what's so special about the Growlithe they gave out with the 20 Feather Balls? Uh, this was a promotion I believe GameStop was doing, if I remember right yesterday. Correct, Michael? Uh, my Growlithe is level 26 and all the stats are zero. Some girl has something to do with a game called Teresa. Gave it away. What's the difference? Mechanical Pinwheel. Ho! Oh, 80 grand. Rob me blind while you're at it. But I know what it's for. I know what it's for. And I'll show you guys shortly. First, we're going to buy everything this guy has. Just so he can get new inventory. I don't know if he'll get new inventory if you don't buy everything. Oh, and I don't have the things this guy needs. Not in my inventory. I need three of them. Apparently, just having them is not good enough. You got to be holding them. Alright, so first let's show you what's up with that $80,000 pinwheel that I totally regret right now. But, oh well, we got it. It is actually a fan. Mix it with a Rotom if you have a Rotom. Which I do somewhere. And you'll get a wind-electric combo. They're pretty good. Game spot. Oh, game spot. That's interesting. Yeah, so you keep buying those things. Oops. And <clears throat> you'll get different types of rotoms. So if you're trying to rotom collect, that's how you do it. So, Michael, what was special about the grout? It's just that its stats aren't at zero. Mushroom hunting with swine up. Okay. 
But it's a good thing we came back. I don't know that quest was there. Here he goes, being grouchier than ever. Actually, he's super chill. But he uh, was very angry with the shopkeeper. Just teleport outside quick. No one likes to climb the stairs, so. Thank you, good sir. It's a favorite it's a not to you. Don't think for a second I've accepted you. <laughs> this guy. quite read everything kind of going through it pretty fast but he run away saying oh my sweet granddaughter she'll never get married all right he just ran away he said something about her never being married real quick and was gone also i do all this hard work for you only for you to take more of my money it might oh man might still be cheaper to just make your ultra balls i don't know so 600 for one what do we need two chunks two tumble stones two apricorns so this is 200 between those four six It is the exact same cost to craft them, Ultra Balls, as it is to just buy them from him straight away. So, you might as well just buy them. What I was doing before they were available in the store was buying all the materials to craft them, but I have a large surplus of the materials now. Extra large. I think there's 10 more, is what she said here at Alabaster Icelands. We only need three more. Ooh. Should we try to get a shiny Mantine? Or is that Mantike? I can't tell. Let's try to get one. I would teleport, but these things won't get off my back. Alright, so we're gonna have to come up rather gently. I tend to disappear right away. Teens. Oh. Okay. This is why we use jet balls.
So it looks like they're not going to disappear. They're just going to try to run. Which honestly just works out to your advantage. As he runs. Okay, you guys are making me have to be a liar. Can't have that. Gonna have to catch you all now. Nathaniel, thank you very much for the like. Cheers. How are you doing? Let me see. I'll need Facebook Translate here. For those who are not collaborators, you exchange us. Hmm. Not sure I know what that means. But uh, thank you. All stats zero, but my mate had two of his stats at two. But I don't see what's special about it. Oh, for sure. Yeah, that's kind of what I thought. Level 26. You know, some of those giveaways aren't too great. But, uh, that's all right. Is this over? No, there's still some. Hmm. I don't see him. Does anyone see him? Uh, that's Gyarados. Where could this guy have gone? And that is a rock. I legitimately thought that rock was a Pokemon. And I don't think they're running either because they keep coming back. I think they just submerge and come out somewhere else. And that's that. Well, that's a shame. Let's help this guy out and get his bag back. We'll be friendly. Maybe catch this um, Alpha Machoke. Because I evolved the one I had into Machamp. Now I just have a Machamp. That is also an Alpha. Got your bag. Once he starts munching, we'll be good to go. Oh, I have made a mistake. Oh, I tripped. I tripped and he looked right at me. That is no bueno. Let me know when Mew 2 comes out. I'll uh I'll let you know, Nathaniel. Hopefully it comes out soon. I think that'd be a fun thing to try to catch in this game. I'm sure at the end there's probably a bunch of legendary hunting or something. I guess it's kinda how all the games work. I got 
50 and a 31. Let's see how good any of these guys are. 38. 38. some stuff. Mewtwo won't be in this game since he is created by Giovanni. Oh, good point. If this game is um, factory in the timeline, it is before he's ever made. So it could be Mew, potentially. Potentially. Who knows? Because it did, correct me if I'm wrong, anybody, but didn't they say that they were working on DLC for this game? I'm pretty sure they said that was in the works, which would be great. I'm loving this. But how long did it take them for uh, Sword and Shield to come out with those DLCs? Hell yeah, he needs his own game. Yeah, we were talking about that, I think, last week. I totally agree. Uh, Pokemon Legends Mew would be fantastic. Maybe it would be one of the best things they could do. I mean, Arceus kind of, I don't know, they talk about him a lot. There's the space portal. That's the whole reason you're here. But other than that, he doesn't show up and do a lot. It's not like he's showing up randomly throughout the game and impacting it. He's just kind of part of the setup. And probably the end. Perfect. Perfect! I had to get him in the back. Yes, there is. I hear ya. I hear ya. Oh, man. I've got to do this four times. There's no effect, buddy. No effect. See if I can get away with getting these four hits off. Nope. No bueno. Now we get my guard chomp out there. The one I raised since. Yeah, I didn't raise him that long. But I raised him a lot longer than the uh, 85 I just caught. I'll tell you, having that steel move, iron, as iron head, I think, is super nice. Means you can pretty much just crush anybody. Alright. So we just need to get one hit off from him. One hit. That we can do. I kind of want to catch this one. Alright, it's gone wrong. It's gone horribly, horribly wrong. All we can do now is catch him anyway. He's actually super beefy. Um, he might be able to do some damage. Never mind, we got him. Alright, uh, this hole right here I have yet to explore. Then I gotta explore up here. And over here. Dang it. 
I was wondering if I could switch mid air a few times. If it would still hurt or not. It does. It does. Foolish attempt and I'll never try it again. Allegedly. Touching it would freeze you. Touch it anyway. Alright, so it was kind of a waste of time now that I just caught that to uh, work so hard on those moves, but whatever. Let's evolve him. Let's see what he turns into. Cute cuddly little fox with a wispy head. And a much bigger emo. Fox with a lot more wispiness on the head. I like him. Okay. I'm trying to remember. Wasn't there like a, a day and night version of this or something? Zoark? Zoark? Bitter Malice, the move I just turned off. All right. I don't think I had the other move that it needed. Nasty plot. Okay. Agile moves. Looks like you're able to catch them straight up at some point. Since it says how many you've defeated. Oh. He looks crazy, though. I love it. He was an alpha? Oh my god. I'd be using him a lot more. Maybe even keep him. But, uh... We're gonna say that that was good. That was luck. We didn't die there. Maybe refrain from using him a little bit. Hey, Levon, thank you very much for the like. Cheers. Oh, no. You notice the camera kind of drags you around based on what's around you. you got some Bidoofers. The barrels, all the bibs. All right, and we have been over here. I think it's Pearl's Village. Rufflets, rufflets. More ruffle boys. Oh, this must be the swine up quest. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to go back and get a swine up. I was not paying attention to this quest, I kind of forgot it was there. We'll just explore anyway, and then we can come back and just focus on the quest. Ooh. I'm wondering if I can climb up there. Alright, 
And this is why having this Garchomp rather than the level 85 one. So we could have that Steel type move. Is uh, so important. Crushed. And it didn't really matter if he was level 85 or 77. This guy's so, so good. Almost didn't see that. I mean, I've got one, but I don't have an alpha. Nice, got it. Level 70. More luck, reference. Those. I don't know what they're called. Barcelona's. Ralts. Eh, it doesn't matter. Trample them. Ruffles. Snuffles. What if you think of a different Pokemon? No, the Rock Rough and Sun and Moon has three different forms. That sounds like what I'm talking about. I just remember that it was in Snap. Maybe in Sun. Oh my god. I just want to be friends. Why can't we be friends? Alright, so nothing up here. Still want to check out where there's that rock up there. Maybe something good up there. I don't know. Might be nothing, but I'm going to give it a look see. I mean, they left these bonnets here for us. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that. What in the... What in the Jimmy John sandwich was that? Could be an unknown. Uh, could be unknown to us. Oh, that sounds right. But the zoo, I think, has a different uh, look for this game. That's, that's what I'm thinking of. Zoro, Zoro, Zoro Arc. I'm wondering if I'm missing, and how many I'm missing, unknowns. At the end of today's episode, I'll find all the unknowns and all the wisps. Explore first, and then we'll double back. This is you? 
I thought that was like W for sure. So I'm missing four here. Let's take a look. We don't have T. We don't have exclamation point, but I think I found O, didn't I? No, I didn't. That was actually the first unknown I found here. There's three others. There's exclamation point, T, and O. We can wrap those guys up quick. Sun and Moon, the Pokemon you have is Dark type. Ah, okay. I didn't know that this was like uh, location based, but so right around here is T. Oops. Supposedly like right here. So let's check him out. Let's see if we can find him. Yeah, I don't want to get out what's in there. We can even talk to these guys quick, just get out whatever's gonna happen here. Well done, us. It's a shirtless guy. I like that she introduced him right away, and his name was still question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. I might actually need the flying mount. Because if he's up on top of this obelisk and I can't climb up there. Let's get to battling. Alright. My musculature. Musculature? I don't feel like I'm saying that right. I hope he's doing squats the whole fight. <laughs> I don't care at all. Oh my god. He's not living through this one. Now, there's quite the gang up. Let's even the odds a little bit. Oh, Frostlass wasn't that strong at all. This guy's supposed to be all muscled out. He wasn't even that good. I think I'm just gonna push through to get in Braviary and then we can get around this map real easy.
go to the temple. Or she's right here already. This guy is working out. Okay. <sighs> so if I can get up there, which I definitely can. I'll get to fly in Braviary. you you can fly it's your only method of transportation all right I know that unknown's got to be up there so catch them we will Quite the hall up here, though. I wonder what these snowballs are used for. Yeah, that's me. Cheers. having fun with you or am I bored? She's awful. Alright, so O is right around here. We'll get that quick. Let me just double check. Nope, definitely don't have it. Alright, so O should be right over here. While we're right here. Let's just go get it. Hello. If you didn't know, that's where Luxio is. Somewhere's about here. I have no idea where or what stands out here. Yeah, hey, many one of these. There's the super guard chomp, if anyone's curious. But he's a beefy boy. Alright, I feel like I'm getting to go a little bit further than I should be able to. Don't 
see him. So I have questions about his weird outlets. I had a column in the ice cave that extends below the icebound falls. Accessible from the hole in the avalanche slopes. There's a hole? Oh, okay. Well, I think there's a description because I would have kept looking up here. Whoa, is that a, sh <gasps> a shiny dust collapse? We're on a shiny roll today. Hell yeah. What are the chances? I'd wager not that high. Here's the hole. Oh, there he is. I was definitely already in here, and I don't know if I would have came back. Okay. I don't know why the jet balls just don't work. Alright, 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 alright. Alright, so our next one is... It's up around this arena. Should be right back here somewhere. It's hanging from a dead tree. Somewhere in that area. Well, yeah, it's right next to here, so we're just gonna jump on over. I wonder, do I have a Reaper cloth too? I do. So I can evolve that shiny if I want. Don't know if I'm going to. But I could. All right, two, two, four, six. All right. So he's almost done. We need four more bitter malices. So I'm gonna get two more here, and that leaves two left. I have to see what I'm missing on those unknowns once I get these last two. Alright, it's hanging on one of these trees. What is this hodgepodge in this pool? There he is. This is the exclamation point. So the last one's up on here. Avalog's legacy, and we can't get to it just yet. So we'll move back down to the camp. Just shake up my inventory here a little bit. My Pokemons. And uh, we'll move up. Since we haven't actually gone up this way yet, we'll have to explore quick. So 
So I'm missing P and Q and T. T is going to be here. Let's see where P and Q are. Okay, so I see Q is back at the beach. And then I don't see P anywhere. So that leaves me a little bit confused. But I know where all but one is. All right, let's get up on the path. Let's get our way up here. So all this right here is new to me. I have not ventured through here other than looking for Carl. Carl? Heather Jones, ooh, with a follow. Thank you very much. How are you doing? Thank you for the notify as well. Cheers. How are you doing today on this fine Tuesday? We got the uh, unfair advantage there. Might be what we need here to do this. Doing good, good, good to hear. You've been playing this game yourself? Hunting for shinies, nice. I managed to find two today. I don't know if you're just joining us or if you've been watching a little bit. We just found a shiny dust clops a little bit ago. Somehow, just randomly, caught him off in the distance. And uh, shiny scissor in the time distortions. That one was awesome. Have you found any today or recently? If not, what's your favorite one you found so far? I think that scissor might be my favorite one that I found. I think the best looking may be the Rabidash, though. I don't know what it is. That, like, purplish blue color on it just looks great found a shiny whirlpool did you catch it because if you can't caught it i'm jealous i had one um over kind of by where the pony taz are and the obsidian field lands and i panicked i got in a fight with it right away it ran away. It's the only shiny that's gotten away on me. And I'm truly upset. You caught it? Ah, oh, Nice. Honestly, I couldn't tell what the color It's like, what, a slightly darker red, right? I guess I didn't get much of a chance to see it before it ran. Well, oh, no effect, look at that. Are you gonna evolve it or keep it as is? As I evolved a few of mine, and now I kind of regret it. I had a shiny Shinx. I evolved it all the way, and then I think, was it over the weekend maybe? I got uh, I got it all the way up to Luxray, I think. Luxray's the three. And I found a shiny Luxray. So now I have two shiny Luxrays. And I could have had one of a couple of its different forms. So that's kind of the only thing that's holding me back from evolving some of these. 
I still might. Got us an Alpha Chimko. Chimico. I don't call them by the right names. I try. Any braviaries up here? Supposedly there's a flying braviary somewhere. everywhere I swear some of the things that live up here don't make sense it's just got a dab of everything we had Dragon Ball Z jokes about Ponyta and Rabidash because blue is Super Saiyan Super Saiyan goes God aka SSJSS and gray silver is ultra instinct and it kind of matches all those they're like 13 13 is a pretty good haul I don't know what I have. What do I have, like... 10? 11? Something like that? I was doing some breakouts here and there when I had a chance over the weekend, and uh, I caught a few there. I found it was, like, one in four outbreaks, and it's probably worse odds than that. I think I just got lucky. One in four outbreaks um, produced a shiny. So I got a shiny Zubat, a Magikarp, and a Lickitung, if I'm not missing anything from outbreaks over the weekend. And then I had, like, I don't know. I must have went back and forth between Jubilee Life and random places trying to get an outbreak for a long time. And nothing would happen, so I was kind of disappointed. They don't necessarily come up all too often it's kind of random and uh it's heads or tails you could get tails a lot of times both doing better than me i played 108 hours and got four shinies oh no what i've been doing is if i go to a certain location say i go to the obsidian um field lands i will take the time to go by all of the rarer things see if there's a munchlax check on the snorlax uh see about the chimchars see if there's any shinies that just happen to be there and if they're not there just kind of breeze them past if i take the time to go past everything i like in an area to see if it happens to be shiny the chances i, I think they're like one in a couple hundred two three hundred that you'll actually see one but You know, gotta try for them. Gotta see, especially those rare ones. God, this person. Am I having fun with you, or am I bored? She keeps asking, but I hasn't given me a chance to actually answer. All right, so we gotta do a puzzle here. I'll show you all my shinies um, once I'm done with this and I'm back at the uh, professor and the guy who carries all my stuff. All right. Rock pattern. Ice pattern. Steel. Steel, ice rock. Okay. Go through the whole place searching for shinies. It's probably a good idea. I mean, they're just going to pop up. 
you never know when so it's good to just kind of keep going round and round um but I found my focus on outbreaks helped a ton. Rock, steel, ice. You press the panels. Hey, it worked. Maybe I found it funny because when we have hunted uh, Beniri, we have catched so many shinies from hunting it. Really, I have not seen. I'm surprised I haven't seen a shiny one of those. They almost look like Reggie's. I think that's the point because it's what the. First game, there was Reggie Rock, Reggie Steel, Reggie Ice, uh, and Ruby and Sapphire. And that's the patterns that these all have. Ice. Rock. Steel. Ice, Rock, Steel. Ice, Rock, Steel, Rock. Ice, Rock, Steel, Rock. Ice. Ice, Rock, Steel, Rock, Ice. Ice, rock, steel, rock, ice. Ice, rock, steel, rock, ice. No problem. Veneery is pink. Well, you couldn't miss that. I think that'd be cool. I like them any time that they look vastly different than the normal one. When they're only slightly different, it bothers me. I'm kind of upset then. Not going to lie. Just love how Wurmple just comes right up to you. It does. Um, there's a few other ones that'll just come right up to you. The rock ice thing that's in this area that uh, evolves in the Avalog. I can't remember what its name is, but that thing just comes right up to you and hangs out. Steel, steel, steel ice, steel ice rock. Steel, ice, rock, steel, ice, rock, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, rock, ice, steel, rock, no, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, 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 steel, ice, rock, ice, steel and the last one was rock repetition it's all about repetition <laughs> I didn't see what was in the basement I hope I'm not going to get locked out of here Let's see them looking right at me. I might run all the way downstairs just to go see what's in the basement. Waiting on the space distortion. That's where I got... Uh, I mean, it's the only place you're ever going to see a scissor pop up. But here, that's where I got the scissor to just today. I never in a million years expected that to happen. Um, and I didn't even know it was him because he was behind me. Just turned around and there he was. It's like a lighter colored uh, scyther. So it's kind of like a lighter colored green going from that red. Looks really good. <clears throat> I really liked the um, bright green Tangrove and Zubat actually is the same color, like a bright green. I liked both of them a lot. Oh, I came all the way down here to see this. 
even guard champs making fun of me. Sleeping. <laughs> I mean, the blatant insult. I should have just checked in the first place. I just didn't know which way was the right way. Uh, I didn't maybe pay attention to it saying to go to the top of the temple. But now I know. Are you in um, the obsidian field lands, Heather? Guessing from the Wurmples being there? What I'll say is when I was there, um, the first space-time distortion, I got was it one or two razor claws right away from Sneasels. Never got one again. Yeah, nice. Anything specific you're trying to get that shiny? I mostly want the rarer things, but you know, I'll take anything. Ooh, that was very, very sneaky. No wisps. Still missing a good amount of wisps. And I'm kind of surprised by that. Alright, play your flute, even though it's the exact same sound I use. Did I read that right? Did she say... All three of them?! What kind of canoodle and noodling is this? This is a joke! Pokemon, why you do this? I mean, sure. Am I gonna thoroughly destroy all three of them? Yeah. But at the same time, still, what the hell? Play dirty, and you got shown up for it some people who raised this girl I tell you what oh yes yeah, so you're looking for EVs nice they're pretty rare there aren't they except for in space-time distortions I guess but, but, aren't they pretty low level? Um, they're in comparison to finding EVs, say, here. Looking for the evolutions. I have not seen many shiny evolutions. I saw somebody else who had uh, Umbreon. And uh, instead of, I think it has like yellow rings normally, it had blue rings. And my god, it looked so good. I was shocked. It made me instantly want one. Oh. Makes me curious what the rest of them look like. Vaporeon's my probably, probably my favorite, so. I feel like it would be like green or something. Or maybe it'd just be a slightly different shade of blue. Um, Michael up there, he got a blue Psyduck. That was super awesome. I have wanted a blue Psyduck ever since. So I stock areas where there's Psyducks. Just pass through, just taking a look. Shiny Sylveon and Shiny Espeon? Oh, damn. 
I mean, if you get them all, that's going to be pretty cool. And you, did you find Shiny Sylveon and Shiny Espeon as was? Or did you find them all as Eevees and then evolve them? Shiny Espeon is green. It's green? I thought it looked blue. Well, that's pretty cool either way. What am I thinking of? I'm not... Um, Umbreon is what I'm thinking of. It has the blue rings. Espeon is... The one that's normally pink, right? Oh, I see what you mean. I like that green. Ooh, Sylveon's like... Pink and blue, and then it reverses, so it's more blue and has like pink liners that's pretty cool you traded for them nice do you have to trade shinies uh, different kinds of shinies Nice. Exchanging shiny Alpha Gyarados. Oh. Shiny Primplup. Oh, wow. That's pretty rare ones for some pretty rare ones, huh? Cadabra. I was like, what is that? That makes sense. Nothing here. Man, I'm quite confused on the Will O Wisps. I'll find them. I think there's actually one up on one of these. Hey, there's that unknown. And that's T. Oh. Alright, still getting the hang of it. Espeon is green. I know. I know. I didn't at first, for sure. And I was definitely saying the wrong name. Alpha Shiny Gyarados, though. That's impressive. Was that a magic carp at first, or...? Did you get it as a Gyarados? You got a shiny Psyduck looking for Bunny. Michael tells me, finally got the shiny Psyduck. I thought it was because, uh... Because he was working for charms. I thought that you had gotten a charm for it.
This guy almost climbed up one time, got within six feet. I get here finally by flying, and he's already up here. So we meet next, all right. Deuces. You got the shiny alpha Gyarados as a shiny alpha Magikarp. Oh, nice. Just got a regular Magikarp. Shiny, but still shiny. All right, let's let's find the rest of these Wisps real quick. Now that we can fly around. All right, so there's two up at the temple. Got that. This one. There's one back here at the top of the village. That somehow I missed because I've definitely been up there before. I do have one shiny alpha. I've managed to find, and that was. Um, oh, what's his name? Drapion? To be honest, I wasn't impressed. He's essentially the same color. Maybe I can get to the top of this. I guess I didn't think I could. But uh, totes can. Huh. Kind of. You were so sad that day you got the alpha shiny. Well, more confused than sad. I was just kind of upset that the colors sucked because it didn't look shiny. I even had to ask. I'm like, what's shiny? What's shiny? Michael saw. He's like, oh, it's Drapion, Drapion. So I turn around and look. I'm like, he doesn't look shiny, but I'll catch him. And engaged in the fight with him right away so I could catch him. Sure enough. There he goes, a shining. 14. All right, so this is 14. Let's look at the image. Behind, actually, I could see it as soon as I looked up behind the hut. Alright, another one done. So we're looking at one right around here. Ah, there it is. didn't want to land me there. Alright, another one bites the dust. Five. Now we're looking right over here. I just think, you know, if they're going to be shiny... They may as well be shiny. <coughs> nice. 
nice. Four more wisps. I think there's another one going to be right around here. One right up the hill. Somewhere right behind me. Oh, look at that. That would have been hard to find. You gotta follow the, uh, uh... Whatever those things are called. On the walls. Boom, boom, boom. There's supposedly two here. It's also one right back here. Let's... Oh, can't do any more map markers. Must be only like 20 map markers. Working on getting my final star member. I'm pretty close. Yeah, let's not report yet. T. Anyway, here's the shinies. Did I get another one? I did. Dust claps. So I've got 6, 12, 18, not bad. Drapion, who I'm not too fond of. He looks essentially the same. It's like purple to pink. Alkazam, kind of the same thing. It goes from brown to pink, a little lighter color on the yellow. Luxray, I like a lot. Blue to yellow. And I got two. All because I have all of my shinks. I found tan growth in a uh, um, outbreak. I do like him a lot. Scissor we just found today in a time distortion. He looks awesome. Actually, Alakazam was a time distortion. Shinx and Luxray were just out in the blue. Drapion was out in the blue. On the open. Rabidash. You know, you get the Ponyta when they first introduce Shinies to you in the story. And that was pretty good. Need 17,350. Nice, nice. Pretty close. Ponyta I randomly found in an outbreak. So I got a Ponyta and a Rabidash, one of each. Uh, Goldum, as I've renamed him, added the D in there because he's kind of gold. Uh, I found a Geodude randomly. Evolved him all the way. And then I opened up a rock, found another Geodude. How about that? Driftblim, uh, I found a Drifloom and evolved him. And then found another Drifloom. They're kind of common, I think. Cherubi, Outbreak. Magikarp, Outbreak. Zubat, Outbreak. I really like Zubat. Lickitung, Outbreak. Roselia was out in the bow, up by uh, Roserade in the Mirelands. And Dusclops just now. He's kind of pinkish. Pinkish, orangish. Actually, let's finish up with the Professor. I... want to see if I'm done. Shinify him. To next rank, I got 1,770. Oh, 1,200. I'll get there eventually. I'm pretty close. But that last rank, oh, let me tell you, it is slow. All right, let's get rid of him. Oops.
Okay. So you two are going. Goodbye. And let's decide. One of these shinies should come with us. Scizor. He's hanging out. Look at him. Hey, big guy. Get it. We get it. You're shiny. Alright, so like right up here. Up here, actually, somewhere. Nope, I see it. Almost immediately. Not sure how I missed it so many times. Uh, before. Two left, two left. Let's get one there. It should be one right around here. I press the wrong button when I just want to go fast, and I end up die bombing a lot. On a Paris outbreak right now? Ooh. I wonder what color Harris comes out to. All right, one more. Should be able to easily find the last one. Uno dos tres, cuatro cinco. So that means there's one more around Avalug's ice that I've missed. This is one heck of a way to shiny hunt, huh? I think I got an alpha swine up. But I can't be certain. I'm gonna have to catch him. Hmm. Okay. Let's look over this one more time. Here, but where? East, on an icy hillside. I'm not going east. Or was I? No, nope, I am going east now. Nope, I, I don't know that one. See if I can use him in the cave. Ram. Oh, 
Oh, there it is. Somehow missed this. Just caught two alpha pairs in the same outbreak. I found one alpha in an outbreak ever. It's kind of rare. Get rid of everything. I know where everything's at now. Oops. Clean up the map a little bit. Alright. Now let's go check on this guy's quest. We also need to get that swine up and work on that quest. tell here Got 218 out of 215 there's like 240 something don't much know what I'm missing lady not anymore if someone has finished the game you can get one um, get more than one alphas in an outbreak oh yeah this isn't there like mass mass outbreaks is what they call them or something is she the one who's gonna give me the peep lock do it. Or maybe it's the swine up guy. Swine up guy. It's gotta be. Alright, let's get that swine up. Come back out here. Speaking of, we'll trade out uh, left to buy. I don't know. I don't like that you glide so you can't really maintain this for a long time without having to start and stop over. I don't know if I find a shiny rufflet. Oop. nice we're finding them all right give me exactly one minute i'll be right back just gotta go to the bathroom one minute Those guys are vicious. 
Whoa. Ah, I figured that was gonna hurt. Oh, didn't see that coming. Snow run. Guard champs fighting all my battles for me all the time. You know what I would really take? A shiny guard champ. One downside I can think of to having shinies is when you use them to forage for you and collect stuff. The fact that they shine every time. Because once in a while, I throw it and I keep running. And I go, wait a minute, what? There's a shiny? You hate to miss one. They're so rare. So it kind of throws you off. guy crossing his arms on me where's the peat block when do you get the peat block all right targeted targeted Supposedly there's a quest for somebody who'll give you a peat block, and it's slightly irritating because um, I thought I'd have one by now. Only slightly, though. Let's beef up this scissor. Gotta make sure he's um, good enough, strong enough that he's worth keeping around in the all the time. And now that I've invested in him, you know, he really is. If I don't find this peat block soon, Maybe that'll be another boring task I'll add to doing over the weekend. Is just actually digging around the Mirelands until I find it. Apparently there's only like a 5% chance. It's pretty, pretty low, but... Who knows. I forgot already what the first thing I said I was going to do. No, no time to rest. Goodbye. I'm gonna have to change this out. Call it the tradable box, but I don't think we're gonna do that anymore.
Only 20 points. That's not a lot. Um, Alright, so... That should be all the Will-O-Wisps, right? I needed, like, 10 left, 3 to 100, and there's supposedly 107. Also, what's up? What's happening? Ah, they're just getting stuff built. Three grit rocks. I think night. I'll use these on Empoleon first. Just because he's so beefy. Hold on, before I go. I thought there might be some new quests in here. We better check on them. See what it entails. Ha! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh. That's just silly. Okay. So she's in the uh, new builds here. This lady got one of the nice shiny big houses. I thought he'd hang out while I talk. Guess not. Lady's got a tall order asking me to just find her place for this thing to live. A little rude. She's just sitting there. She can go do it. Mago berries. Some of these have, oh, let me do that. Two things, like the berries have two options. So I was just seeing if anything else did. So I get robbed blind. Well, that's not gonna work. I gotta say that's one of the things that I um, really enjoy about this game is the development of the city or town. GB Life must be a town. It sounds familiar in one of the other games. Cut by the sea. Come on, lady. Send me on a wild goose chase here, and she's ultimately just gonna accept it. She's gonna go, ah, actually, it's pretty cool. I'm gonna keep it right here. You just wait.
chime. Well, not gonna work, Ida. Ida, keep it if you, I were you. Ha <laughs> ha Name pun. Everybody loves those. All right. Looks like we finally done chasing around here. Yeah. Oh, it's happy here? Alright, well, either way, we've done it. Chai. Oh. Doesn't want to do that. Looks like there's another quest that may have popped up in... inside the head main building? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, just just move it to the neighbors. She's one of those people. Oh, not happy. Could have called that one a mile away. Oh, it can stay with me after all. These people, the people in this town and some of their requests are ridiculous. Sir. Is it normal to lick people's Pokemon? In this town it is. There's the guy who loves licking combies. Can you catch a combie and once it's No. Better have saved. This is the second time this has happened to me. Save often, people. Ah. Last time it auto saved, I maybe lost like 30 seconds. I'm hoping that happens again. It takes me back to the horrific days of like PS1, PS2, where there was no such thing as auto save. And if that happened after you spent out, I like, I remember as a kid, I would send like five six hours on a game on like a saturday and that would happen it would be game over i do have auto save on luckily all i have to do is talk to him again <laughs> Woo! <laughs> but but i have nightmares from such a thing remember as a kid i never broke any controllers i was really good at remembering it costs a lot of money and my parents aren't going to buy me another one if I break this. At least that's what they told me. I didn't push it. You know, some kids, they'll get their new controller. No problem. But, uh... I'll save that one for last. But I would just gently, after almost throwing it, set it down and walk away. And I wouldn't touch a video game for the rest of the day if that happened. And I don't know. There was times I wouldn't come back to that game for days, weeks, or months on end. Usually if I came back after a game froze and I lost hours of work, that was it. It was over. I'm going to forget about it. I'll come back. 
when I feel like it, which is maybe never. It is truly one of the most frustrating things that can possibly happen to a person. And the invention of autosave is one of the best things that's ever happened. There has been times where autosave will screw you over. Say, um, if you saw a shiny and you didn't catch it. Like, you could save right before it gets away or something. Uh, and then autosave brings you in right after. For a Pokemon example. Hello, goodbye. Oh my god. Oh! Go, 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 go. <laughs> yeah, I just... I don't like messing around with those guy chomps. Catch my first Pokemon in gold. And um, unplugged the charger because it was running uh, off power. It shuts off straight away. Made me cry. I was 10 then. Oh no. I can imagine. It takes a while uh, of walking around with those eggs in those old games. Especially when you could have something more useful in your party. It's like a certain number of steps you had to take it. I can't remember what it was. Because there was times where I would just run in circles around town. Just aimlessly look away. Drink my juice box. Keep running in circles. Okay, if some of the pages are missing, why are words missing? Right? Why are words missing from the page? Oh, shenanigans. You know, I never checked on his moves, but it looks like these are just mine. For this fight. That'll do. One of four different types, even better. All right. Was that uh, first egg that you hatched Togepi, if I remember right, in gold? Am I just fighting it? Am I catching it? Who knows? Maybe both. I feel like that's gonna hurt a lot. It's not. No choice but to win this battle? Deal. Good night. So when Togepi could just go into Togetic, evolve into that. Togekiss, I actually like a lot. I would consider using it if I had like a shiny or an alpha version. I have not been able to find those. Still missing some pages. Alright, well, whatever. 
Oh, it's kind of giving us some clues of whatever we might fight or run into next. Just a little bit. Just a little bit of some rest right now. All right. Alola. Ken Ken. Oh. I really do like the Alola or whatever. Alolan Vulpix. But I haven't seen one yet. There's just five of them somewhere? Or... What? This is... One vague mission. Also something I wish I had when I first explored the entire area. Is there going to be any kind of giveaway? I feel like I could survey the area pretty quick, but I don't know. I don't know about this. Are they in specific spots, maybe? rather insulted by this quest. That's the thing about a lot, a lot of the requests in this game is a major amount of them are just like, alright, there's someone or something out there uh, and I need you to find it. Don't know where, couldn't tell you. Just find it, bring it back. I don't have time to answer your questions. There's so many like that. Every camp that you set up in every area is that way. Oh, well, someone got lost. I don't know. They're nearby, I think. Can you find them for me? Sure. Let me just get right on that. All right. Where are these? Nintendo life. Okay, so they're all in one spot. Does it say that? It just says they're in the ice lands, but they're in the slopes. All five are in the slopes. So it looks like, if I'm looking at this right, you will fly straight if you're going regular speed. You won't glide at all. But um, if you speed up, that's when you glide. Do you add me as your friend on Switch? Sure. Uh, I don't know how. Just black RAM, I think. I really don't know much about Switch at all. I just use it for games like this, and uh, I haven't really added people before. Hey, yo. 
are, you little possum. Oh. So I'm not catching him. I'm just... Talking to him. There's one. Kyo Kyo. Not the noises they make, but a hey, who's counting? There's one near this guard shop, I swear. There is, but not that close. Uh oh. Cheers. one I honestly don't know how many I found one two three four four maybe Ken Barbie okay one more there he is Sir or madam? Keen. I honestly thought they were going to be like one in every corner of this place. It was just going to be awful. like in the game but just one just one that's it number caught five of six technically so if that's a thing then maybe you'll be able to catch more Chomp's too good, so it's got our main here. Actually, I like Electivire too. Torterra is coming out. Vulpix is pretty beefy to begin with, level 40. Oh, and it counts as I already have him because he's just Vulpix. So that's why you only get one, because technically your Pokédex is all good from the regular ones you got. I much prefer this Ninetales, I'm going to be honest with you. I love the icy Ninetales. Ice too. You'll be the only one. 
now that I know I don't actually have to raise him, Torterra can come back out. I don't think there's anyone really want to work on or needs to be with me. Nah. I could probably sub out some of these guys for some of the ones I got. I don't know if they'd be as strong. Like, I could think about putting Torterra back. Nah, uh, nah, I don't know. I'm just going to keep these guys. So we'll report this stuff back to this guy. Oh, only a hundred. So it looks like we'll have to complete the story in this area tomorrow. But we'll have just enough time to do all these side requests today. Catch whatever the thing is that you get from the Will-O-Wisps. We'll finish with that, so that'll be a big moment here. Looks like we had a few big moments. Finding a couple shinies. Easily dismantling that twerp that sent three... Big ass Pokemon at me. And catching this thingy at the end here. Yeah, 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 yada, yada, yada. You got your book. It's not the peat block, but I'll take it. Also. figure out where I'm going in a second here. I want to see if I've got all of these or if I'm missing any. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. Oh, 22 is missing. I think that's what I'm working on. Okay. Seventy two is missing. Seventy nine. Is that it? It's just seventy two and seventy nine. Sixty seven. All right, I need to write these down. What did I say? 79? Yeah. I'm trying to look at this real fast, and I feel like I can easily miss these. One more quality assurance check here. Okay. How am I missing this many? Request 67. The Clefairy's Moonlit Dance. By catching a Clefairy. And it looks like they pop up in the Meyer ones. Okay. Well. By that sticky glob. By 
that snow pattern rock. We'll buy that honey cake. Make sure I don't go to the wrong place. This is still how I'm gonna finish the episode, so. I will catch up on these other quests that are missing tomorrow. Search for peat blocks real quick. There's two places that are guaranteed to have an item spawn. Okay, here's one. Sky tumble stones. I mean, 20 sky tumble stones, pretty good. Not what we want. There's one right on that side and one right on this side. And I think you can just teleport around, teleport back here. And eventually you'll find one, but like, yeah, kind of sucks. We'll start here. We'll get this person's bag real quick. And we'll meet him up at the ruins. Oh, and one of the other guaranteed spots is right over here. God bless America. It couldn't just be a peat block. The one thing I've wanted for all of eternity and then some. We can just scoot right up here. Take a gander boot. This is something else. Being able to just soar above everyone. Oh, that rock, okay. Oh, wrong time of day. I sleep, might as well hunt for some peat blocks. That's a shame. I don't know why they had to make it so incredibly tough.
but of course they did. This is honestly the hardest thing. To catch or get, I mean, I don't think I've got the quest yet that it's going to help us get it. Maybe it's one of these three that I'm missing. If I switch it to Nightfall, is uh, this person going to be there? Or am I going to see a time change by the time I get up there? Let's find out. We'll just save here, just in case. Definitely wanted to call it a strange one, but I'll be nice. Just in case, what if she is a Pokemon and attacks me? Feeling pretty sus. Spirit Tomb, alright. About to get Spirit Tombed in this ball. One and done, baby. Let's go. Oh, no. Guard Chomp's pretty beefy. We'll put Guard Chomp on there. Should be fine. Get in the ball, man. This thing's just messing with me now. Well, I guess it always was, wasn't it? Don't like attacking things to weaken them, because I don't want to kill anything. I'd rather just beat the crap out of me while I try to catch it. Eventually it will submit. God. 
No. Alright, Torterra is going to be able to deal with this real well. Typhlosion, my strongest one, is going to get hit by uh, super effectives the whole time, so I can't put him out there. Absolute last resort he is. Oh, I feel so good about every single one. Oh, now I see the resemblance. What a weird Pokemon. Not gonna lie, going a little bit crazy with the inability to catch this thing. He's putting up one heck of a fight. There it is! Woo! I think I saw online, I don't know if it's true, there's like a 1 in 400 chance that it will just be here in this spot. I don't think that's true. Interesting. So is he like it's kind of like a legendary or is male and female, so it does have that. It does have preferred foods. Is that gonna somehow tie into this whole thing? Honestly, we can finish him in the Pokédex right now. Hex and Strong Style. There's ghost Pokémon everywhere. This should go pretty good. I think if I do this one more time, it's usually, what, three is the second level? Second round of points. Should be done. Psyduck. Sorry, I'm going to have to beat you up because you're not blue. Why couldn't you just be blue? And that should be it. Seventy left. Whew. Yeah, actually, we can leave. Or we can take one more crack at these peat blocks. Wow! All right. One more crack at it know what I'm saying? Holy shit.
I have been waiting for this for so long. We'll put him with the legendaries. I consider him the legendary, I guess. Her? I, I don't know. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, it's got to be a full moon. I'm wagering not a full moon. Still incredible. I finally found it. Finally found it. And it was just like, oh, let's just do one more before we end the whole episode. Boom, there it is. What a way to end it. Oh my god. Hey, Susan, thank you very much for the like. Cheers. Alex, thank you for the like as well. Good to see you back. Cheers. Uh, hello, how are you doing? I think it's a full moon, isn't it? I'm just trying to get a full moon here so I can evolve my Ursa Luna. But I am not having any luck. You gonna be on tomorrow? You betcha I will. I'm on uh, every Monday through Thursday, six to nine Central Standard Time. So good three hours, four days a week. Same as usual. You? I'm huh? doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. We uh, explored all of the Icelands. Did all that good stuff. We just got Spirit Bomb. I finally got this peep block. I'm having a heck of a time using it. You have this game on Switch? Nice, nice. How are you liking it so far? I love it. I'm getting pretty close to catching them all, but... Well, not Nightfall. Finally got this Ursa Luna, well, hopefully soon here, uh, that I've been working on for a century. I think. Let me look this up real quick. Because I am struggling to get this. Oh, the shiny one looks pretty cool. In Use a peat block in the Crimson Mirelands during a full moon. Is there a specific area? Like, uh, what am I missing here? I'm missing something. This is a full moon. Just foggy. I'll try this one more time. One more time. Give up. Figure it out tomorrow. I don't see a moon, but I have yet to see a moon at all. Yeah, whatever. All right, well, it was a fantastic stream. Thanks, you, Evan. Thanks you. Thank you, everybody, for joining. Um, we did a lot of big things. I don't know why that's so choppy. Sorry, I've just got to restart my computer, I think. Anyway, explored all of the Icelands. We got all of the Wisps. Got Spirit Tomb. Done almost all of the quests. Discovered three that were missing. So we got to go back and do some more uh, extra things here. Somehow got to figure out how to get the full moon for Ursa Luna. So we got a few things to do tomorrow. Um, we'll get through those. Probably finish the story here in Alabaster Icelands. And I believe there's one more area after that. So pretty exciting stuff. Uh, it's going to be a good stream tomorrow. Probably find more shinies. We did find two tonight. Dusclops and Scizor. So 
That was pretty fantastic. Uh, so the question tonight, for those of you over on YouTube or watching after the stream, if you're on Facebook, you'll probably be able to see the answer. Uh, I've just shown the answer for those of you in here right now. Uh, which of the following is not a metamorphic rock? Um, is it slate? Nice, I think is how you say it. G-N-E-I-S-S. Uh, is it obsidian or marble? Put your answer in the comments there. Um, and I will go through those now. So... Nobody voted for Slate or Nice. Again, don't know if I'm saying that right. Anyway, uh, those are incorrect. 43%, though, pretty big half, voted for Marble. Incorrect. It's not Marble. Uh, it is, in fact, Obsidian, which 57% of you voted for. Congratulations, those of you who got it right. You guys are smarter than me, because I definitely did not get it right. Uh, so let's do some shout-outs quick here. Uh, thank you to... Let's see. Marcus, for the like and the shares right in the beginning. Appreciate you wishing me luck and all that right there. Uh, thank you, Pitsy, for stopping in and dropping a like right in the beginning. Appreciate it. I haven't seen you in a while, bro. Um, Michael Payne, thank you for the like and chatting along with us today. Uncanny Lup, thanks for chatting along a little bit. Thank you for liking as well. Kayla, thank you for the like. Sam, thank you for the like and share. Um, I said Nathaniel earlier, and I was way wrong. Uh, Nafail. Thank you for chatting a little bit with us as well. Thank you for the like. Thank you, Levon, for the like. Thank you, Heather, for chatting along. Thank you for the like and uh, the follow. Appreciate you on those. Uh, Susan, thank you for the like. And Alexis, thank you for the like and chatting along as well. Appreciate all of you guys and everything you guys do for your support. Uh, it all goes a long way. So we'll uh, put this up on YouTube here tonight. Don't... Uh, don't miss out on that. Black Ram GX Gaming over there on YouTube. We got a bunch of shorts. We'll put up another one tonight. And uh, we'll put up the full stream there. So thank you again, everybody. If you're watching the Facebook stream here after uh, we're no longer live, feel free to follow. Our goal, you might have seen a little bit ago, was 250. We're at 240 tonight, thanks to Heather. So we're 10 away uh, before the end of the month. Hopefully we can get there. But we'll see. So anyway, we'll be back tomorrow. We'll be doing a lot more uh, exciting things here with Pokemon Legends Arceus. 6 to 9 Central Standard Time. Don't be late. We'll see you guys there. Stay fresh, cheese bags.